uh, before anything uh, install android studio my version is 4.2.1 so you should install the version 4.2 or above 4.2 uh, i recommend don't use the uh, latest one because you need to upgrade in gradual and dependencies all things so uh, make sure your android studio version is 4.20 or 4.2.1 okay so this is my version okay so what i will send you i will send you one drive link this rescue dog drive link so uh, inside that folder you will see this kind of file what you need to do just select all just select all and right click and download okay it will download as a zip file you need to wait uh, for loading the file and it will automatically download as zip file okay after downloading the zip file see what you need to do you need to extract it in a folder suppose uh, there is a folder in new folder uh, in new folder i will extract the uh, um, code link zip file zip file and extract the zip file here okay after extracting the zip file what you need to do uh, okay just wait uh, wait for wait for wait for few minutes i will show you i will show you how to uh, do all things okay um, okay wait um, okay uh, download is ready it will automatically download as you see here it is auto automatically download as drive download and whatever the name is uh, so after downloading um, it will i think it will download here in my download folder okay so just wait it is all downloaded uh, okay in my download folder it is downloaded just um, cut from here and paste it in a folder then extract it here i extract it Okay, now what you need to do, you need to go to your Android Studio, go to your file, click open and go to that folder. My folder is in D and it is in, I think, new folder. Where is new folder? No, this is not new folder. I think it is inside. Okay, new folder too. Okay, do one thing. Uh, rename it as new rescue dog okay now this is the app new rescue dog this is the app so don't ex don't open this app okay always open the above app okay this app this app means uh, wait this app means this folder it will only open this folder you need to open gradle thing or gradle and git git ignore file also okay so what you need to do click here and click ok uh, other, uh, sometimes it will show an error like uh, vgs root map error so just ignore it and sometimes it will uh, up, um, show an error like your JDK, Java JDK uh, path is changed, so just click OK here because my Java JDK path, path is different than your, so just click OK if you occur that kind of um, error. Okay, now you need to uh, wait for the Gradle sync. My Gradle is now build, it is in build process. If there are any kind of error in the code, after um, Gradle build, it will automatically show. If there is no kind, if, if there is no error, it will just show build is successful in here in build section it will show as build is successful okay now you need to wait for gradle sync okay after gradle sync uh, your android structure will look like this okay this is the activities and this is the layout and here this is the layout okay so now what you need to do you need to uh, you uh, you need to add your SSO one certificate in the Firebase thing. The uh, the Firebase thing I will send to your Gmail ID like this. Uh, you will uh, get an email from my side from Firebase like this. Just you need to click on Open Firebase Console. Um, after clicking this, you will see that kind of layout. So what you need to do? Just go to the settings. 
project uh, project setting and below in below there is an option right at finger pinch what you need to do just add here and you need to add your sh1 certificate so from where you get your sh1 certificate just go to your gradle and click here the gradle icon and here right uh, sign in so report sign in report and click enter after clicking the enter uh, you will see your sh1 certificate here okay this is your this is my sh1 so here will be different so copy this sh1 certificate and paste it here then click save okay after saving the sh1 certificate what you need to do you need to uh, download the google service.json updated google service.json file just click here it will download the global service json file what you need to do you need to copy that google service json file and um, you need to paste it under the app so just here from drop down select project and go to your app section and here uh, there is already there is already one google service json file what you need to do you need to just delete it and paste it the updated one okay after that you just simply um, select this to app and here no device in no device you need to connect your device you need to connect your real device and just play play means run the app okay after running the app um, what you need to do uh, one thing also you need to do in the real time database in real um, as i already mentioned in the video that uh, the achievement part you need to um, admin need to add manually from the database so how you can uh, edit the achievement so here you are here already four achievements are here okay so i need to add one okay so for that what you need to do first of all you just see the structure of the one okay every structure is same okay there is a id zero one zero uh, one id uh, below zero one id there is a uh, this is key and this is value this is key this is value okay make sure this is key and this is value and all value are in string okay here this id is in string abc means string here it is also in string abc there is a string abc means string okay so what you need to do uh, you need to decide a uh, achievement there is a plus sign okay just click here this is a key and value so first of all what you need to do if i need to add this key and for this key there is no value right so what you need to do mm, there is four so next will be zero five make sure it is in the serial process okay it is in serial way so this is five and for five there is no value right there is no value so what you need to do uh, below five there is a key and value so what you need to do below five again add one okay now key is here make sure your key your every key should be same see in one in one key is eid description image rescue bar in key two eid description image rescue bar here key should be same here value should be different because every value yeah, here is different but key should be same okay so what you need to do here go and key should be a i d a i d a i d and here when you enter a i d it will take as number right right because id is zero one it is uh, basically a number but in the app in app in java file i mm, add this value as string so what you need to do here zero five there is uh, so one error because this is uh, by default it is a integer but i here added as a string so what you need to do just click here and change it to string okay now it is okay here is string so make sure you should uh, make this string so next what you need to do description 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 so i just copy this description here and paste it here description next one is image and for image what you need to do you need to go to a storage here i already opened the storage section in build there is a storage section you need to open the storage section and in uh, storage section there is the achievement images right achievement image folder what you need to do go to your achievement images folder and upload your achievement here uh, here i already uploaded the achievement like um, this kind of a achievement after and before a kind of thing this is just a demo purpose you can add any kind of image if you want so just click here 
any image now below that image there is a file location right click here and below file location there is a access token okay don't copy storage location okay copy only access token if you click here it will automatically downloaded the it will automatically copy the downloaded url okay just click here it is copied now go to your image and paste it here your image location your image url is now set then again we need one key that is rescue by rescue by so give any kind of name like suppose mr uh, mr just okay now after adding this just click add it will automatically add the value as you see in five there is a aid description image rescue by there is a new data okay you can also edit the data just click the value and edit it just click the value and edit any kind of data you can delete the whole 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 key just click here and delete okay this way you can add edit and remove any kind of achievement from here okay now rest is automatically um, created the data because you when user register it will uh, automatically um, under the user database when we chat that chat value will uh, automatically updated here chat list also book post mean uh, whatever the requested uh, the user made by the app this will come up here okay so this way whole database work okay uh, that's it uh, for now if you need any kind of uh, information or any kind of data then contact me okay thank you